How Dare the Sun Rise is the inspiring, heartbreaking, and true story of Sandra Uiringi Yamada's escape from Rwandan genocide when she was just 10 years old. The book opens with a terrifying scene from a United Nations refugee camp in Burundi where Sandra and some of her family were living in tents. Armed gunmen entered the camp and started killing refugees, shooting, stabbing, and burning them. Sandra barely escaped and was certain that she had seen her mother and her little sister murdered right in front of her. In all, 166 people died that night. Not long after the attack, Sandra and her surviving family immigrated to America. We see Sandra's surprise at the poverty and danger in Rochester, New York, where at times she wondered if she had been safer and happier back in Africa. Sandra was invited to speak at a women's conference in New York alongside celebrities like Angelina Jolie and former Secretary of State Madeleine Albright. She meets Oprah and the Obamas, but despite her brushes with celebrity, she still suffers from post-traumatic stress disorder and debilitating flashbacks from the massacre. Sandra's story is gripping for a number of reasons. She draws you into the terror of the attacks in the refugee camp with her first-hand account and later her demands for justice for the people responsible. Sandra's story is also testament to the broken dreams of refugees, as we see both in her first-hand accounts of being bullied and ostracized at her new school, and the tales of well-intentioned people in America offering her family clothing and food that illustrates the vast disconnect of cultural understanding. This is also very timely, because right now, American leaders are seeking to build walls and keep refugees out, while this is a story of what can be gained by upholding the vision of an inclusive America. These are topics that aren't typically covered in young adult literature, and as such, I recommend you put this book on the top of your stack of books to be read.